Hello, welcome to Metaphysics and Magic. This is an instructional video series designed to help you unlock some of the mysteries of the universe. I'm your host, Sandra Richardson. At this time, I'm going to demonstrate the proper way to make holy water. Holy water is also known as blessed or consecrated water. There is no magic spigot that the holy water comes out of. You have to bless it. And the way you do this, you need three things. You need water. Water can be of any type, tap water, spring water, distilled water, preferably clean water. And then you need salt. Salt is the preserver of life. Any kind of salt will do. Sea salt, kosher salt, iodized, non-iodized. And then the third thing you need is prayer. That is what activates the salt and the water and makes it holy and special. I'm going to demonstrate. You take your chalice or vessel of water, you hold it aloft. Then, with your fingers, ritual knife or wand, place it into the water and speak a prayer along the following lines. Behold this water that is the giver of life. I ask that this water be blessed and purified and made holy. In the name of God, a Son of God, in love, light, peace, and trust. Then you take your container of salt and you say along the same lines the prayer. You touch the salt. Behold the salt that is the preserver of life. I ask that this salt be blessed and consecrated and purified. In the name of God, a Son of God in love, light, peace, and trust. At this point, you take some of the salt, whatever feels right, and place it into your vessel. Stir it around a little bit so that the salt dissolves into the water. Clockwise is always the preferred direction. Once you stir a little bit, as you're touching the water and the salt that is mixed together, you say your third prayer. For as the water is holy, and as the salt is holy, may the union of these two be blessed and purified and consecrated in the name of Goddess and of God, by the almighty power of earth, air, fire, and water. May this now be holy water, to be used in goodness, in love, light, peace, and trust. So more to be. At this time, you now have holy water, you can put some upon your third eye to bless and consecrate your body along the back of the neck. You can sprinkle it around your environment. It will disperse negativity and it will raise positive vibrations. And this is the proper way to make holy water. Thank you for watching this edition of Metaphysics and Magic.